February 12th. Must I listen? And they said unto Moses, Speak thou with us, and we will hear. But let not God speak with us, lest we die. Exodus 20, 19. We do not consciously disobey God. We simply do not heed Him. God has given us His commands. There they are. But we do not pay any attention to them. Not because of willful disobedience, but because we do not love and respect Him. If you love me, you will keep my commandments. When once we realize that we have been disrespecting God all the time, we are covered with shame and humiliation because we have not heeded Him. Speak thou with us, but let not God speak with us. We show how little we love God by preferring to listen to His servants only. We like to listen to personal testimonies, but we do not desire that God Himself should speak to us. Why are we so terrified lest God should speak to us? Because we know that if God does speak, either the thing must be done, or we must tell God we will not obey Him. If it is only the servant's voice we hear, we feel it is not an imperative. We can say, well, that is simply your own idea, though I don't deny it is probably God's truth. Am I putting God in the humiliating position of having treated me as a child of His, whilst all the time I have been ignoring Him? When I do hear Him, the humiliation I have put on Him comes back on me. Lord, why was I so dull and so obstinate? This is always the result of once we do hear God. The real delight of hearing Him is tempered with shame and having been so long in not hearing Him.